outside of Tom Brady, Tony Romo's story is one of the greatest NFL Romo's stories. Romo's next pass will be his first in an NFL. five-yard line and down to the four. It's one of the best stories in the history of the sport. Kind of Kurt Warner-ish in his ability to come out of nowhere and be overlooked by everybody. Touchdown to Terrell Owens! And Romo has his first NFL touchdown throw. Tony Romo comes off the bench, takes him right down the field. Shook his fist in raw excitement. So to go where he's been, from a third-string undrafted <laughs> guy, yeah, I think he's overachieved. Mike, the first thing Bill Parcells said to me when he came out of the locker room is, I'm going to play Romo. Bill Parcells, who on Thanksgiving Day said, you know, I got this third stringer, this undrafted rookie, who's probably the best guy that I have. He is putting this team in Tony Romo's hands. Reaching out behind him, caught it. His first touchdown of the year. Big story all week long quarterback and quarterback of the Dallas Cowboys is one of the regal positions in all of American sport. The, the world started to pay attention when he became the starter for the Dallas Cowboys. Well they need to get you'd, you'd like to get to the 25. All right here we go from the Dallas 32. Tie game a minute left. This is the stuff of classics. He brought glamour back to the quarterback position. Of Dallas. What an absolutely perfect pass between Aikman and Tony. It was six years of a gravel run. Perfect pass over the shoulder of Witten. What a play. Kick has legs. The kick is good. The kick is good. Martin Gramatica. For basically a decade, he is the face of one of America's most iconic sports franchises. Shotgun. How do we look at Tony Romo in Dallas? 6-3 Hawks. Shotgun snap to Romo running up the middle. Tony Romo has been a top five quarterback over the past decade. Pushing through two defenders. Touchdown, Patrick Creighton. His wins didn't match his talent. Because in football, just like in business, you can't do it in an island. Lots of time. He's in the end zone. Even the great ones need help. Caught. Touchdown. With a big hit to Terry Glenn. And like an old Timex, he keeps on ticking. He made them better than they otherwise would have. I mean, they would have been right. bum, bum team right. if they would have had, say, Alex Smith, but who's a fine QB. Fourth down and one at the two. Play fake. Bootleg right. Touchdown, Marion Barber. Four touchdown passes. First and goal. Little quick fade out to Owens. Crosses the goal line with the pass. Touchdown. Touchdown, Terrell Owens. For Tony Romo, no Cowboy quarterback has ever thrown for more touchdowns. I spoke with Terrell Owens at the Super Bowl in Houston, Texas. His uh, the best quarterback he ever played with, Tony Romo. That's that's kind of high praise. I mean, it's high praise, and I think that's what T.O. said. Dallas leading 27 to three. Barber deep in the eye, two receivers on the left side, tight end right. Romo play action. Left hand corner, touchdown, Terrell Owens. It was over the top of Darrell Revis, who early in the week, of course, Owens was asked what he thought about him, and he said, I don't know who he is. Romo looking left, now middle, now middle. Now I think they should remember him as a great quarterback, especially in the era when he played in the league. I just think the people that you compare him to are out of this stratosphere. Touchdown, Terrell Owens. Beat two men, and Romo beat six of them. A ridiculous throw by Tony Romo to Terrell. Well, Gramatica will try to give Dallas the lead here. The ball will be spotted by Romo at the nine. The great quarterbacks, Tom Brady, Joe Montana, you would wait for them to lead their team and catch up. So it's 19 yards on the right hash for the lead. With Tony Romo, you would wait for him to lead his team and f*** up. And on the most unlikely series of events it slipped out of his hands Romo simply juggled the snap and was tackled at the two yard line those moments his failures stand out just because of the way they occurred and when they occurred to have it end like that to have it end with the potential winning field goal with a minute 19 left to play sitting right there and to have the holder who is the starting quarterback simply drop the ball the first time it's ever happened well, what is going on in Dallas Tony Romo 
He, he ain't no superhero. Oh, high snap over his head. He ain't Superman. He wasn't even Troy Aikman. Picks it up and runs left at the 20 robot. He ain't Aquaman. Gets away from one man. Left to the 40. To the 50. First down. <laughs> Out of bounds at the 45. They're parading him around like he was that dude. He was not that dude. That one puts him in, in the hearts and minds of Cowboys fans forever. I'm better towards Tony Rumble. He gave me one of my lowest points, and he ran the ball about 25 yards into the end zone. Rumble scrambles in for the touchdown, plants the ball down in the back line of the end zone. Spiked it. Place is going crazy. The underappreciated. Who says... Who says Tony Romo is underappreciated? It panned to Jessica Simpson. This is when Jessica Simpson was skinny and hot. And I just remember Free thinking, combo. the rest of my life sucks. Like, uh, my life will never be as good as this guy's right Everybody's now. Everybody's talking about this uh, Jessica Simpson factor in the upcoming game between the Giants and the Cowboys. Swing to the drum, swing it to the top, swing it to the base in the back. Back when he was younger and went off maybe to Cabo. So, so how long did you uh, date? About two years. Four days away from the biggest game of the year here at Texas Stadium. And Cowboy fans are kind of concerned about that trip they took to Cabo, Mexico over the past couple Just of days. Just had a couple of days in the sun with Jessica Simpson. You're supposed to do that. You're the quarterback for the Dallas Cowboys. Now it's fourth and 11 with 16 seconds remaining. But now it comes down to one play. Uh, he can have Jessica Simpson in his life. That's not the problem. The problem is turnovers. Intercepted. Giants. McQuarters. And the New York Giants are nine seconds away from advancing to the NFC Championship. Um, how will people view his career? It's my team. It's my quarterback. Will they view the moments of failure that kind of have stood out like the Seattle moment and the turnover against the Giants. A minute 16, fourth down and three. If the season ended today, and obviously it will not be, but if it ended today, Tony Romo would get my MVP vote. Romo looking over the middle, pumps, he's in trouble, now he rolls to his left. He took every bullet for six years as this franchise was in disarray. Great catch by Hurd at the 40, coming right to the 50. A block from Choice to the 30. I mean, this is a sandlot as sandlot gets, but I'm telling you, how many times have we seen it? Held them together with glue. And a tough son of a gun. Yeah, very Played through yes. everything. Yeah, Punctured yes. this, broken that. Five, and he's getting up slowly after a big hit by Carlos Rogers. He carried that franchise when they didn't have a great offensive line, and they didn't have a defense, and the Cowboys were whiffing on drafts. Kitten has been intercepted twice since taking over for Romo at halftime. You're a 49ers <laughs> fan. Yeah. You don't remember the game this year I with do. broken ribs? Yeah. That's not leadership tonight? Tony Romo is looking for his helmet on the Dallas sideline. How about this? He's coming into the game, it looks like. That, that was actually, that's one of the most impressive moments he's had since he's been a Wow, and Romo got hit again. Doug Free pulls Romo off the deck. He doesn't have the playoff victories, but there's a reason for that. It's because football is a team sport. It requires a balanced team to now win. It's a team sport. And he has never had a defense. And a touchdown for Miles Austin. How about Tony Romo with the week that he's had coming back? This is what uh, this is what legends have made him. This guy was criminally underappreciated. You look at his numbers, they they dwarf Troy Aikman. We literally came in on the same shuttle bus to training camp. 12 years flies by, and there's a bond that's bigger than football, according to Witt, it's a brotherhood. We always felt like when the game started on Sunday, 
we could win because we had that guy at quarterback. Touchdown, Cowboys! Tony Romo digging into the bag of tricks, 43 yards. He's pulling away from the most dominant defensive player. Tony Romo with his bad back, bad collarbone. Yeah, slot here. Romo loses the ball. And Romo is down. Tony Romo in the last two seasons has really only played in four games. And so he's been injured a lot. Like, honestly, Tony may have been one hit away from being a paraplegic. Uh-oh. Tony grabbed that left shoulder for a moment. If you remember that, he was done. Toast. Your, your time is over. The guy had broken backs and kept coming back. Broken backs and serious injuries. Yeah. It's not all good in Dallas. Tony Romo has two fractures in his back. We have back. serious concerns, but what happens if he has another back injury? What effect does that have on the rest of his life, his family life, his ability to enjoy life with his children? He may have been one hit away from not having the ability to enjoy the rest right. of his life with his family. He was the one who became a convenient whipping boy Absolutely. for a lot of their fans. No, we he, both were We were always defending him, and we always knew he had elite talent in this league. Snap to Romo. He's down by four. Looking around, looking over the middle. And this is one of the best players of his era. Over the middle, with down at the 22. He's down by four with a minute 19. Back to throw. Looking left at Bryant. Comes back, gets it, slips a tackle, 15, get out of bounds, and does. But in five years' time, will we see him getting a gold jacket, or at any point? I think he eventually becomes a Hall of Fame. Throw on an empty gun, looking left, looking middle, pumps, looking right, looking left, standing, 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 standing. Touchdown! Des Bryant! A minute one to play. He made iconic plays in big games that everyone who watches football Splash. saw. You may not, you may say that's ridiculous, but that's how the voters vote. But how about Tony Romo keeping the play alive in the pocket? Romo still on his feet. But Romo could cap off at Washington. Uh, uh, an incredible year, his best year of his career. What situation for Tony Romo? Can he deliver for the Dallas Cowboys? First down to Williams, the rookie. He is the all-time leading passer in Cowboys history. Looking around, can he run it on that leg? Tony Romo, statistically, is one of the greatest quarterbacks this game has ever seen in basically every meaningful category. He's number one in passing yards, number one in touchdowns, number one in passer rating. Here we go. Third and goal. Murray trying to stretch it out. He's going backwards. And he is back for a huge loss. Harry Riley. The guy is known. He's notorious for um, choking in the big moment. Here for all intents and purposes this season. Fourth and goal. Time for Romo. It's in! Touchdown! Tony Romo, your career numbers there, and making his second start of the preseason. I don't think so. I got a feeling Romo goes down again. Tony Romo no. is injury prone. He is. I agree. Second and seven. Because I think that Romo, even though he says he's, uh, he feels better than ever, he's a year older. He's had some damn sure. crippling sure. type yes. of, yes. you know, of injuries. And if he goes down, well, we saw what happened. We yeah, already we know. Saw. If he goes down, we yeah. already know the answer to that. Under pressure, Romo. We'll go down. Uh, he's, oh, holding oh, he's holding his back. Holding his back. So Romo's terrific NFL career, Mike, has come to an end. It's all said and done now for number nine. Oh, but the only one that fans seem to care about right now goes by the name of Jack.
I'm going to bet on Dak Prescott to be the story of the year in the NFC this year. I feel like we all have two battles or two enemies going on. One with the man across from you. The second is with the man inside of you. That's reflecting. That's poignant. That's looking at your career in the rearview mirror. And it has been officially documented, stamped. It's over. And 49ers rush five. Romo flushed out. Now up the middle. Now Cox and throws. Cut it at the 30. To the 20. To the 10. To the 5. He broke tackle. I think a lot of people, when he's gone, you don't really miss what you have until it's gone.